kanichul, kimba muli rap wana ji, kimba no kumik set abon, kakin cha na wabakaon, tung abashun ni chunchi. Kikbona, kava tumpa kul paliya moka paata. Ji yoka kul tumpa kul paliya. One. Oska, chis kanichu. Da rupa botenya no gigi piti. Kipuna, kava tumpa ku pelea muka bata. Kiyo kaku tumpa ku pelea. Two. Kiyo kaku, kimba muli rap wana ji. Ku yami juski chika nai. Uba maska dwana chichopa muska. Jiska da soki kupa bona na chachu. Tune, hudu. Rana nu prata dunko shirkasha. Doom a big head. Three. Oh! Oh! Ah! See you there. My attention was kind of focused on the Twi'lek dancers. Look at them waggle those head tails. Don't worry, honey. Alien girls aren't really my thing. I'm much more interested in an attractive female of my own species. I don't like the tone of your voice. I work for David Kang. I'm used to people treating me with respect. I'm one of his top couriers. Davik's always sending me off planet to deliver and bring back packages. He knows you can trust me to follow my orders to the letter. Plus, I used to be an intergalactic customs agent, so I know all the tricks they use to catch smugglers. That gives me the edge I need on my courier runs. It's not like it's some big secret. It's kind of hard for Davik to keep a low profile when he belongs to a big intergalactic crime syndicate like the Exchange. Davik's ship is the fastest one in the entire quadrant. But even the Ebonhawk can't get off Taurus until the quarantine is lifted. The Sith fleet has the planet surrounded. Any ship leaving orbit without proper access codes will be disintegrated by the Sith auto-targeting laser cannons. And those codes are locked safely away in the military base. Davik's pretty upset about it. His smuggling operation isn't making any money. But even with his underworld connections, he can't get his hands on those codes. Hate to see a pretty lady leaving, but you ain't the only girl in this place. I guess I'll go back to enjoying the dancers. I told you to leave me alone. So give me some space, bug eye. Your breath smells like bantha poodoo. <laughs> Tong patoga smak tilia, abi tubong funky punk pa, tali tuama ji human aku ikatune. Who you call a little girl, tuba face? Uba batu konchi, jiska da soki kupa bona na chaju. Just a sec, boys. Zalbar, a little help here. I need you to rip the legs off some insects. Quit complaining. You can finish eating later. Besides, you need the exercise, so get over here. Kiyo kaku! Kimba muli rap wana ji! Ku yami juski chika nai! Kupa maska dwana chichopa muska! Jiska da soki kupa bona na chachu! You got a problem with me? Then you got a problem with Big Z. So unless you want to take on my furry friend, I suggest you greenies hop on out of here. Kiyopasa! Kimba muli rap wana ji! Kaba vulpa murji guma ya! Hey, relax, Big Z. No need to be rude. Sorry about that. But Wookiees ain't much for conversation, you know? Say, I don't recognize you, and I know pretty much everyone in the lower city. You must be new down here. I guess that makes me and Big Z your official welcoming committee. It's not that strange. 
Most aliens can speak basic, they just prefer to use their own language. But I grew up here on Terra, so I just sort of got used to speaking the native tongue. You showed a lot of guts dealing with those Valkyrs, kid. You got a name? My name's Mission Veo, and this big Wookiee is my best friend Zalba. I offer to give you a tour, but the streets down here aren't safe. But if there's anything else you need... We just kind of fell in together. It ain't easy on your own here in the lower city. Everyone's always looking to push you around. So we noticed. Still, you seem like an odd pair. When I met up with Zalbar, seemed like a pretty good match. I knew we could look out for each other. With my street smarts and his muscle, we make a great team. Well, you came to the right person. If you want info on Lower Terrace, I'm the one to talk to. Davik, the Lower City gangs. I even got the scoop on that bounty hunter, Kalo Nord. Davik's part of the Intergalactic Crime Syndicate, but I guess everyone knows that. But I hear he's got a new ship for his smuggling operations, the Ebon Hawk. I don't know much about space travel, but I hear that ship's fast enough to break the Sith blockade. Of course, this is all just secondhand rumor. Where would he keep it, do you know? If Davik does have a ship, he's got it locked up in his estate. Nobody gets in there, except the people working for Davik and the Exchange. There's only two gangs worth worrying about here in the lower city. The Black Volkers and the Hidden Becks. Sometimes Zalbar and I hang out at the Beck base. The Becks are led by Gadden Beck. He's a good guy. Lost his sight in a swoop bike accident a few years ago, but even blind, he's a great leader. Not like that traitor Brezhik. Before he took over the Volkers, he was a Hidden Beck. Gadden considered that ungrateful space slug his adopted son. When Gadden went blind, Everyone figured he'd step down and appoint Brezhik in his place. But Gadden figured Brezhik wasn't ready yet. He wanted him to wait a few years. But Brezhik was too impatient. He left to join the Volkers, and ever since, he's been waging a war to wipe Gadden and his Bex from the face of Terrace. This gang war in the Lower City is totally the Volkers' fault. They're the ones killing everything that moves out on the street. It's like they've gone insane. Davik's part of the Intergalactic Crime Syndicate, but I guess everyone knows that. But I hear he's got a new ship for his smuggling operations, the Ebon Hawk. I don't know much about space travel, but I hear that ship's fast enough to break the Sith blockade. Where would he keep it, do you know? It... Kalanord's one of the most famous bounty hunters in the galaxy. He's killed more people than the Iridium Plague. I've seen him kill people just for trying to talk to him. He hangs around Zack's bounty office, but I don't think he's looking for work there. All the postings there are small time. Way beneath the bounty hunter of his caliber. I figure Kalo has been hired by Davik to do a special job for the exchange. I'd wager a thousand credits that as soon as the quarantine ends, he'll be getting off this rock. You going? Yeah, this dive is pretty boring. No action around here. Come on, Big Z, let's go. <laughs> Can't you think about something besides your stomach for five minutes? Come on. We'll go see if there's anything good to eat at the Beck base. None of the Becks or Valkers come into the cantina anymore. I guess that's one good thing about the gang war. It's not so crowded in here. This gang war is getting out of hand. The Volkers aren't just attacking the hidden Becks anymore. This gang war is getting out of hand. Uh, I can't wait for the big swoop race. I hear Volkers have a new engine that's gonna break all the records. This gang war is getting out of hand. The Volkers aren't just attacking the hidden Becks anymore. These are good times for bounty hunters. I've made a small fortune on the bounty Zax has been paying out. I saw you kill Bendix Starkiller. I was just about to bring him in, too. I'll stick with the bounties Davik puts out. They're usually less dangerous than the government-funded contracts. I saw Calo Nord in the tap room. He's a legend in this business. I wonder if he'd give me an autograph. These are good times for bounty hunters. I saw you kill ba-
Kawa do Paco, Paliabo Capata, Bodana Chaco, e. Chan Chacula, Umra Chis Caducci, On Chubanjis, Chagi Locha, Wana Wama, Kawa Volpa Multi, Gumana. Kava dumpa kapalia mona pata, bona na kachu. Ti umpa dopu na kita, ak ti kondo ona chaba chisa wanki. We ti membo rang thong, muli ra on shanturing um ni patoga wanga. Tonga book sha um nag nong. King Kun Shi Kakichin Awana Wamata Nishi La Chorga King Rundi Ichawa Tongbola Johnny Ku Yuma Wama Nibo Lora Waisha Waga Shi Ching Takum Justak Miki Grabul Moko Runda Di Hotonga Kun Hoka Genchopa Chawi Ti Chop Twis Yun Kun Watu Yama Kama Wuna Henak Nek Bona Na Kachu Kicha Badwang Wanga Kum Kiba Bu Mule Rat Kudu, Tony Rama na praka donko searcha chupa panki bona na kachu kicha badwang wanga kum kiba bu mule rag. Mulira on shattering um ni patoga wanga chonzi te. Shagji kina lorcha watamwana kin kun shishi kin ni kin kun ban mula ragji kun wama kun best ching pala mule tune rana nu prata donko searcha domatama ucha hatunga ya fulke jachiska do punta kasa baka bana uto mokao dang ya foki jachiska do punta kakaspaka bana uto Takum justak miki grabul moko kachichu ita botunga tolo bank wale oganda naru chuchut mule shapunga bola wana chikne mule slimo puto dada nanga kumbis mule rabes. Gigi hakuji locha kinku na va mule rigi kum kachichu tola podo to punto casa tabong. I the Haldanga wala ganto da naga to chuchu mukiti chokai ti umbikita. We team and bon rang thong. Muli ra on shanturing um ni patoga wanga chonzi te. Ika krotu haku jije. Watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Kipuna. Ona na kacho. Oh, my God. 
Justice is one thing, but doing a crime lord's dirty work is something else. You again? Why do you keep bothering me? Wait, think about what you're doing. If that pig had just kept his hands to himself, I wouldn't have had to give him that scar with my vibroblade. He gets drunk and tries to force himself on me, and I get a bounty put on my head for defending myself. Where's the justice in that? Holden's the one to blame, not me. I guess I have no choice but to stay here and hope Holden cools down. With that bounty on my head, it's too dangerous to go outside. Again, I see. I guess the old Holden charm is still... You're here about that? I guess Zax must have mentioned me to you at the bounty office. 
Fair enough. I don't care who takes her out. Just so long as the job gets done, I can't let her get away with what she did. That wench tried to cut me with her vibro blade. What? I can't do that. Think how it would look. I work for Davik. I've got a certain reputation to uphold. I can't let her get away with this. There has to be payback. Although, I do feel a little guilty about all this. Dia's a good-looking gal. It'd be a shame to kill her. Tell you what, I'll take 200 credits in exchange for lifting the bounty. If I let her get away with it, I'll look even worse. She's got to pay, either with a life or 200 credits to buy my forgiveness. Don't worry, I'll stick to my end of the bargain. I'll go tell Zax right now that the bounty is off the table. What do you want now? This whole thing with Dia is over, so we don't have anything to discuss. Hate to see a pretty lady leaving.